Hello everyone. This is Ganga Barunwal and today I have come up with the topic sentence. So let's get started. First of all we will know what a sentence is. A sentence is generally defined as a word or a group of words that expresses a complete idea or sense. That means if there are some words and they are in a group and the group is giving a complete thought or, or a complete idea that time it will be a sentence for example the cow gives us milk let's see some more examples first he is a good boy next is he present today next what a nice weather next do it last go you can see that there are some sentences and all of them are of different types of expressions first one is a statement next one is a question next one is an exclamation do it is an order and go is also an order now we'll see part parts of sentence every complete sentence consists of two parts a subject and a predicate what a subject is the part of the sentence which talks about the person or a thing is called the subject of the sentence whereas the part of the sentence which talks about the subject is called the predicate of the sentence here we may see one example ram likes to eat mangoes ram is the subject of the sentence because the sentence is telling something about the liking of ram and what is it telling it says that ram likes to eat to eat mangoes so in this example the subject is ram and the predicate is likes to eat mangoes to determine the subject of the sentence we first find the verb in the sentence and then ask who or what in the sentence in the above sentence we first find the verb and the verb here is like so we first ask who likes the answer will be ram likes and this is how we determine that the subject is ram further we'll see kinds of sentences there are four kinds of sentences first declarative sentences second interrogative sentences third imperative sentences and last exclamatory sentences first of all we'll see declarative sentences what's a declarative sentence a declarative sentence makes a statement it ends with a period declarative sentences give information for example the boy is happy the people are running there are two examples and both the examples are of declarative sentences let's see next one next one is interrogative sentences what's an interrogative sentence an interrogative sentence asks a question it ends with a question mark means the sentences that ask a question are called interrogative sentences there are three examples i have written here who studied for their test last night how do you drive a car what do panda bears eat you can see there are three examples and all of them are the questions so they all are interrogative sentences next one is imperative sentence what's an imperative sentence an imperative sentence gives an order command advice suggestion and request it ends with a period or an exclamation point for example go to your room stop please give me your pen these sentences are the examples of imperative sentences now next one is exclamatory sentences what's an exclamatory sentence an exclamatory sentence show great emotion or excitement means exclamatory sentences are those sentences which show 
great emotions or excitement for example wow look at this scenery hurry holidays have started alas he has gone there are three examples and all the examples are of exclamatory sentences now students we have seen definition of sentence how many parts of there of a sentence there are two parts for the we saw kinds of sentences now i have given something for you for practice you have to identify and label each sentence as declarative or interrogative or imperative or exclamatory first one is where's my shovel it's a question next one please pass the lemonade it's a request third i am going to climb the tree it's a statement last one how pretty she is it's an exclamation thank you so much have a great day